G'day guys, welcome to another episode of Adventure Unlimited. Yep, so today we're gonna, um, we're all packed up. We're gonna hit the road shortly and uh, probably check out a few of the, well, one or two of the sites that Israelite Bay has to offer. The grave site and the ruins. Yep. Last night we went for a walk and checked out the jetty. It's a lot smaller than we were expecting. Um, Israelite Bay itself, there's not a lot here and the road in is disgusting. Um, so if you like coming to Israelite Bay, let us know in the comments what you do here because can't see a lot of appeal. Unless you're doing the track that we're doing and you've got no option. Pretty much. Yep. <clears throat> All right, let's get into it. It's gonna be a good one. Well, that's probably about two, two odd hours of driving down. It's a hard slog, like 15, 20 k's an hour the whole way. Stop to put the lunch in the travel buddy. And I hear the bars open. Barman's restocking. Yeah, stop drinking them all. Just trying to find a nice spot along the beach to have some lunch. Pretty wrecked. We've only been driving for a few hours, three, four hours. Um, but the first probably half of the track that we've done so far has been pretty slow going. The first section could just sort of switch off in second gear and cruise along. There's plenty of whoops, but was comfortable enough um, and then there was probably about a 15 20k section uh, where you just had to stick to first gear uh, heaps of whoops heaps of uh, like little trees and branches and stuff across the track um, so yeah I didn't get out of first gear for like an hour that takes it out of you a little bit 
Uh, we just went down to one beach um, at the turn off sign. Point Culver one way, Israelite Bay the other, beach access the third. Uh, it's getting close to high tide. Um, that beach, like a lot of them, full of seaweed. Um, so we're just going to try and find another one that's maybe a little bit more protected. I'm not sure that it exists looking at the map, but it's still before noon, so plenty of time. Very enjoyable track so far. It's like lots of different landscapes. There's some sections that are heaps like the Holland track. It's real dry clay, big wombat holes sort of sections. Um, there's you know, some soft sandy sections, but for the most part it's pretty hard sand, very tight. Uh, it would be very difficult to tow a caravan through here. You might be able to get away with towing like a little tinny or small camper trailer or something like that, but um, the track is very narrow and there's lots of tight S-bends. So, probably not recommended for a caravan. But we're going to keep tracking along. Try and find a spot to enjoy our leftover curry from last night. Bill Bunya dunes in the distance. Just gonna let a little more air out. What do you reckon? I reckon that they're fake. They don't look real. It looks like a big pile of ice cream, or it's been photoshopped. This is unreal. It's like another planet. With anything? Okay. With anything? Some chips. Or med chips.
what's on the cards for today. Coffee. Coffee first. And then the dunes. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out so Try not to hold me down Feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me No, no, nothing can break me Lay my troubles to rest Blow the smoke through my cigarette Myself, or I could be someone else No one's stopping me now I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I just wanna feel alive It's just what I do when I'm out so I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes Try not to hold me down Feel alive We just ducked off the beach to uh, try and link up with the main track and the change in scenery is just unreal. It's like we're on the surface of the moon now.
Good afternoon. We have pulled up at Point Culver. Uh, not quite sure if this is the start of Baxter Cliffs or they're just further along. I'm not too familiar with the geography along here. However, get a load of this spot. How would you describe the driving? That's right. It's a nice little track. Nothing too exciting. Yeah, so the track in we took, um, not on HEMA or Google or anything, however, if you're on the main track, let's move in here, get out of the wind. If you're on the main track, um, heading west to east, east to west, when you see Point Culver on Google Maps and you're directly north of it, there's a track that heads towards it. And it is rough as shit, but it's all worth it in the end. Cause we got a primo cam spot. Is it? Paul loves the wind. Carly likes picking campsites so that windy as Look how cool it is. Once I've backed up the drone, I'm gonna put it up. Cause I'm not, it's pretty windy. I'm not super keen to lose it in the ocean with the last couple of days of footage on it. But it's very cool. All right, we're gonna have some beers and chill out. Think about what we're gonna do tomorrow. Welcome to an episode of Five Beers Deep Can Kitchen with Adventure Unlimited. Tonight we're making a tofu stir fry. We've chopped up the tofu. I'm not gonna lie, we've been on the road for 11 days and we don't have a lot of fresh food left, so we haven't topped up. But in here, I've got some capsicum, mushroom, some broccoli stalk, because that's all that was left and some onion. I'll be cooking up some rice noodles. And if there's room, jar of chickpeas. Let's get into it. So first up, just boiling some water for the rice noodles. Probably unnecessary this early, but seemed like a good idea at the time. Next up, just heating some oil in the pan. Gonna heat up our tofu. Heat up whatever protein you want. Once that water's boiled, bang your noodles in. And then once your protein's browned off, and this is well and truly brown, set it aside. Next up, we're going to cook the veggies what's left of them until they're soft. Look at that view. All right, those veggies are getting soft. Now you're gonna drain your chickpeas and add them in. Spill a little bit. We're just gonna add in a little bit of garlic. I thought that was ginger. It is actually garlic. Healthy splash of soy sauce. Next up, we're gonna take another moment to enjoy the view. While a fly crawls in your nose. All right. Now that's done. Tofu back in. And 
and rice noodles in it. On the next episode, we make our way from Point Culver, uncover some more incredible scenery. We find another incredible camp at Twilight Cove before finally making it to the Airbird Observatory. What do you reckon? I'm gonna do the with. <laughs> Guilty! I'm trying to stay off the beers, so I better stick to it's just apple juice. It says 6.9% apples. <laughs>